Hi there, I'm Audie Corpus, Product Manager at Douglas Lighting Controls. We're at Light Fair 2017, and I'd like to give you a little overview of some of our latest products. Before we look at some specific products, let me talk to you a little bit about Douglas Lighting Controls. We've been doing lighting controls for over 35 years, and we really started with large centralized systems for large applications. But now we can offer wireless solutions, standalone solutions, and even distributed solutions for room control applications. Let me walk you over to some of our latest products and we can get into the details. Our wireless system really starts with the power pack. So this has a 20 amp relay and also provides zero to 10 volt dimming and has a Bluetooth chip in it. So what it does is it communicates to other devices in that Bluetooth network. You detach this power pack to a fixture or a number of fixtures to one power pack and that gives you the base of controls. Then you add in switches, sensors, and even an iOS device with Bluetooth capability to control an entire room. This overview right here gives you an idea of what our wireless system would look like. So you have a sensor, a controller attached to a fixture, a wall station switch, and even a control app for commissioning and room control. All the devices communicate around each other and through each other to enable a robust system that's very reliable. Wall station control is easily added into our Bluetooth network using our standard looking switches. They're Bluetooth enabled, and once you put them on a wall, they're powered by line voltage. The communication and control is via Bluetooth. Each device again acts as a node within that Bluetooth network, sharing information across the mesh network. The switches are really interesting because you can also not only use them as straight on off switches, but in this example of a four button switch, all of them could control four different zones, you could set each button as presets for different types of applications, for meeting rooms and presentations, quiet time, a low light level that you'd like to have, or you could even set them to control zones in a particular type of configuration. A lot of versatility comes with our switches, and we use our commissioning app to set up those types of functionality. Expanding the system is really easy because it's on a Bluetooth network and Bluetooth, using Bluetooth technology. Here we're showing our network app. So what this is is an iOS device with Bluetooth capability, and it's got user control as well as commissioning in the field for our entire Bluetooth system. What the app will do is you'll be able to identify Bluetooth devices within your network, then you bring them into the room that you've designated to control, and you set up configuration and control using that app. Once you see the list of products in there, you can actually identify each one by hitting the attention button and it will flash or flick the LEDs so you know you're actually speaking to that particular device. Then you can name that device in the system and configure it either if it's a button or a sensor in the way that you need for that particular application. If we want to tie this system in to our large centralized system, we also have a gateway. So the gateway is another Bluetooth device. It takes those commands and passes it up to our dialogue controller. On this wall, we're featuring a dialogue centralized system. The types of applications that this really applies to are large stadiums, hospitals, educational facilities, government buildings, and commercial offices, from large towers to standalone types of buildings. So right here, I'm showing you our dialogue switches. This is actually the back of the switch and the connection point of our dialogue network. Power and data are provided right off of that 18 gauge two wire connection. It's easy to install and again, it's non-polarized or polarity neutral, so you don't have to worry about contractors putting the wires in backwards. The two wire connection is really that easy. The switches are digitally controlled and multifunctional. So this is the front of the switch and as you can see, there's a number of different settings you could use for it. Again, with a number of our switches, they're digitally controlled, fully addressed, and they're powered and provide communication along our two-wire bus. This one's set up for possibly a classroom or an office type application where you have a morning setting, there's a lunch or a setting or afternoon setting, and an evening setting. So the light's going to be set in a particular way for each time of day. You could also set those up to just be straight up application or presentation mode. Each device in the dialog network is controlled through that two-wire standardized bus. That runs as a backbone and then you just do T drops off each device to connect into the network. New for this year is our centralized controller. This is an update to our existing product, but it adds some functionality and features that weren't in the previous models. 
One of the most important factors would be this is BACnet native, so we don't have to add in a BACnet card. As you can see, the scheduling, the presets, the outputs, the groups, the modes, all the functionality and the brains to the system sit behind this device. This is the, a CPU with a touchscreen LCD in front of it. We've enlarged the LCD. We've also added in daisy chain capability to tie in to multiple controllers within our network. From our centralized controller, we move out into peripheral devices, which are used in the room. So these, again, run along our D2, or Dialog 2 wire bus, and they connect back into the centralized controller along that data and power bus. Switches, again, have advanced functionality to not only be on and off, but you can program them to be dimming, or presets, or control particular zones. We have even key lockouts for particular types of applications where you want a master switch to shut off or turn on all the lights or have control over them. We also have a line of sensors. Our occupancy and daylight sensors are dual technology, featuring PIR for the standard technology or primary technology, and microphonic technology for the secondary technology. Our proprietary microphonic technology uses an advanced protocol to actually listen for voices and not be disturbed or create false triggers that would come from outside peripheral noises from HVAC systems or cars or children running outside. Today we've touched on a few of our latest products, but I really want you to understand that Douglas Lighting Controls is a complete solution provider. From centralized to distributed to standalone and even wireless technology, we've got a solution that works right for you. Please do visit our website and you'll see a full list of our reps that are available.